of North Carolina is recognized for one minute. Mr. Speaker, I've heard more than one person say common sense isn't, isn't so common anymore. And boy, isn't that right. Well, today we have a unique opportunity to pass common sense legislation that will truly help the American people and strengthen America. I am proud to co-sponsor H.R. 3, the Keystone XL Pipeline Act. It's projected that this pipeline will create more than 40,000 good-paying jobs, and it will create far more jobs indirectly by increasing our energy supply. At a time when our families are struggling to make ends meet, it's irresponsible for the President to walk away from doing what's right for America. Building the pipeline will help us achieve energy independence. This is an opportunity to strengthen our position in the world, eliminate a key revenue source for our enemies, and strengthen our economy by lowering fuel prices. Even I urge my colleagues in both chambers and the President to support the Keystone Pipeline Act. This is an opportunity to show the American people that there is still a glimmer of hope for good old common sense. Mr. Speaker, I yield back my time. The gentleman yields back. The gentleman